Hello my lovelies, how are you all doing? I hope you're keeping well and staying crafty. Now I'm on for day 28 of the DYI CAD 2024 challenge. I will leave the link in the description box. Today's prompt was steampunk and I sort of knew what I would like to do um back in january i think it was i did some ai stuff and i did some giraffes and i did this giraffe <laughs> and we've got janet's corset was so tight it sucked all the color from her legs thank you mr doodle for the words or that he said about janet's corset being too tight and uh, he said something else about the legs and we sort of juggled it about but I was very grateful for Mr. to Mr. Doodle because I just could not think of anything he kept coming up with all sorts of things and I said no that's a bit too rude we want it comical but <laughs> so that's what we've come up with and I love it I love it so much um, so the background paper is from this book that a lovely Trudy sent me this page I actually cut a piece of the blue one out but it, it wasn't right so I used the lighter coloured one thank you ever so much Trudy for that I do keep using it uh, so I stuck that down and then the, the as I say the little image I'd done back in January did a load of giraffes but she didn't have the legs and I've recently started using a program called Canva. I've mentioned it before. You can do AI stuff on there as well. But I just added some little like legs to it, little human legs. <laughs> and I did, I, I was trying, I thought, oh, I could put some actual netting on her skirt and it just didn't look right. And then I got some lace and I thought, no, it, it just on a little tutu it just didn't look right so I've left it as it was and then these pieces down here this piece and uh, yeah that piece and that piece that piece up there and that piece were all on the card that I'd done the giraffe with uh, so yeah, I'm really pleased with it. <laughs> Love it. And I really was so grateful that Mr. Doodle come up with that because I don't know why. I just wanted it to be called Janet and I just couldn't think of any. It's really weird because sometimes we both think of several things that I'm like, oh, yes, I like that. I like that. Which one shall we choose? But we've we've struggled. But Mr. Doodle got there in the end. So, yeah, it, it's such a lot of fun. <laughs> Look at a bless her. Oh, little corset is tight. No wonder she's got anemic looking legs. <laughs> With a little parasol and her steampunky goggles. So, for, for this one, I would have put in something like um, giraffe wearing a tutu with the corset steampunk style something like that i mean I, I can't help but keep saying to people if you've not tried the ai stuff just have a go at it if it if it interests you i mean it probably does you probably got no interest whatsoever but don't be frightened go on to bing uh, and it's the bing image creator or i mean there's loads of other places as well but as bing was the first one i used um and just you know put in different words imagine a scene or you know it doesn't have to be wacky like mine if you're not that sort of wacky person you know do whatever scene you know type just type in words of whatever sort of scene you're looking for and it comes up with four little boxes and you know can just they I will say though you can only print out um sort of it think it's four by four inch pictures I haven't actually tried 
printing bigger ones because I'd read somewhere that it's a good program but you can only do the small ones but um, if I go, I'll go to this other program and you can add to it and different things but it, it's real good fun anyway five minutes 20 seconds so I better go love you and leave you and thank you again ever so much for watching and uh, I hope you like Poor Janet in her corset <laughs> with her very pale legs. <laughs> okay then, take care. Bye.